things to organise before moving in. So your application's approved and you're preparing to move in. Wait a minute, there's things you need to do before moving day. Here's a quick checklist to make sure you've got everything covered. Utility connections. Does the property have gas? If yes, you will need to connect it. You'll also need electricity and probably the internet and phone. Unless you've checked no on your tenancy application for connections, in which case you better get cracking, a utility company should contact you shortly to organise this. If you've heard nothing three or four days out from your moving day, please contact your tenancy manager. Beware, remember to make your own inquiries about phone and internet lines, as this is not the responsibility of the landlord. Also, don't forget to disconnect your utilities from your current residence. MyConnect may be able to assist you with this as well. Tenant insurance, a very small charge to give you peace of mind. As a tenant, you're responsible for insuring your own contents. Even if your belongings, including your furniture and appliances, are damaged or destroyed through no fault of your own, you can't claim through the landlord's insurance. They cannot insure your contents. Things out of our control can happen. Imagine a flash flood, a fire from an air conditioner, or your burnt toast. You'll have to find other accommodation immediately as well as buy replacement belongings at today's prices. You'll be surprised at how much it will cost. Tenant insurance is a must. Mail redirection. Speak to Australia Post to have your mail redirected for at least three months. Also, it's a good idea to notify your change of address to your insurer, bank, RMS, etc. You definitely don't want to miss out on that registration or license renewal. Now that you have things organised, time to pack your boxes and get moving.